Okay, a little video here for everybody. This is a UDC system. I've got three key pros. So I set up a button to fire them on. You'll notice they're all in record. Then I set up a button to stop the records. Notice they all stopped. So let's just, so we can uh, have a little bit of media to work with, I'm going to record two videos on each one. I think one of the key pros actually has three. So here's the really cool part. I go up here to advanced, and I go to the Aja Key Pro File Manager. I go to this window, pull it down, and it shows me my three videos on Key Pro number one, my three videos on Key Pro number two, and my key th three videos on key pro number three. So now, if you look over here, that's a G drive. That G drive is connected via USB to this PC. So if I go down here to my Windows Explorer, I can see there's a G drive. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete all the media that I already put on here. So that's a blank drive now. Now I'm going to go over here and I'm going to tell Aja File Manager to download all the media over Cat5 to the G drive. You'll see it started downloading. There's three files. I'm going to go to the other one and download. And there's three files. Now I'm going to go to Key Pro number three and download. And there's three files. So now when it's all done, I come back to my Windows Explorer and I go to the G Drive, there's all my videos. Now obviously it's pretty fast because they're small videos, but you see how quickly it worked. The only thing you have to do is when you're done transferring your media, I created a button to change the record play state from data to record. So now the machines can be sent back into record and record the next show. Thought you guys would like that.